Mayor OG here, and today we have a big announcement. There is a new house in Brookhaven that doesn't appear to have a safe. What? Yeah, this is serious, and this is why I had to come today and make a video on this. Everybody's talking about this new house not having a safe, and I'm like, what do you, what do you mean? There's, there's safes in every house. That's... <laughs> Don't make me bring out my robber side. I will rob every safe in Brookhaven right now just to prove to you there's safes in houses, okay? There was even a safe in the mayor's office at one point in time. And that's exactly why I'm in the mayor's office today, actually. I wanted to go over and look at, well, a lot of things in this video, and I want us to try and find the safe location in the new house. Is it even there? Does it even exist? Well, I'm going to go over all that in today's video. So be here, sure, to hit the like button. We need about two likes, three likes. Okay, I know, I'm always saying two or three likes, guys. I'm, I'm gonna jump a bit higher today and say 10 likes. Let's do it, for Rosie at least. Come on, like the video for Rosie, guys. <laughs> Make sure to follow on Instagram if you wanna see Rosie. Now, uh, I'm always paranoid to check behind cabinets now, guys. You know, after finding the blue key card, I am paranoid. But either way, guys, we did know at one point in time there was a secret safe in the mayor's office behind here. It's oh, interesting, huh? Behind one of these areas. I don't remember what it was, but there was like a photo, a portrait of something, and there was a secret safe behind one of them. So. With that being said, it made me think that maybe that we could get some traces of where would be a good place to hide a safe, right? Well, um, and we're going to get to the house and everything soon. But so when I got to thinking about how in the mayor's office, there used to be a safe hidden behind one of these paintings or like mirror like uh, portraits here. I, it, it occurred to me that maybe in the new house, that's where the safe is actually hidden behind a very carefully placed item on the wall. So, let's go on over there and check that out, shall we? There's a house reported at Residence 15. I don't think I'm going to go all firefighter on them. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, well, it's House 15 here. I guess I should maybe help them out while I'm here. <laughs> it would be rude of me just to be like, yeah, there's a house burning, and I don't really care, dude. So, let me get in here to help you. Let me help you out. Brooke Kai is on the television show. All right, I'm looking for a secret safe, but I'm also keeping, the, keeping Brooke Haven safe, all right? You can't judge me for wanting to help out somebody, guys, okay? This is this is a necessity. Let me get this all cleared up real quick, all right? And I might rob their safe on my way out. <laughs> Am I right, guys? Come on. All right. Let's go out here. In here. Oh, my God, dude. It's everywhere. Okay. Well, thankfully, it's a small house, so we can get this cleaned up pretty quickly to get back to our main objective here. All right. So, let's head on up here. Which she's not even at home. Did she die in the fire or something, dude? I hope not. Jeez. All right. She's not even home. So this is, uh, is a bit unexpected. All right. Let's uh, we just go in here. Then we got to get the bathroom. Wait. Why is there a book on the floor? Is, it, is she... Did you drop the book on the floor? All right. I think I heard the bell ring, too. All right. You guys, we almost got it. Uh, you guys want to get this safe real quick while we're here? All right. Let's do that real quick. It's a, it's, think of it as a nice courtesy. You know, uh, think of it as something, you know, a little payment for the fire department here. <laughs> oh, with G's fire department, I accept my payment, so okay? keep your safes locked up. <laughs> All right, guys, we got the fire safe. Uh, oh, Andrew was helping us out, too. There, good job, good, do good job there. Now, anyways, guys, the house that I'm talking about is obviously the frat house, this Greek-looking house at first that we thought. Now, this being a frat house sort of like vibe, you know, you're probably going to have to keep a safe beyond hidden. It's going to have to be non-existent almost, borderline. Now, uh, I will go ahead and tell you guys that I went ahead and did the honor of blowing up almost every location in this house, dude. I know I see my buddy Darzif, uh, which he kind of got me stuck on this topic a little bit. Uh, he was blowing up like the... Uh, all the little arcades here, Tetris and all. He said, "Blow it up! I don't care." <laughs> oh, the crazy there, Dawson. But um, yeah. So uh, basically, you look around in the house, right? Is there something we're missing, guys? Is there like a secret that we're just not uh, finding, or is there a place in the wall that is so hidden that might have that safe? Well, that is what we're here to do today, guys, to find out. Now we do know this house is full of many secrets, secrets that we never expected. So let's look around the walls and see if there's anything or any place for the safe. Now a lot of people have went ahead and said that there's no safe in here uh, because you know, it's a frat house. It doesn't have safes. Why would there be a safe? But for some reason, I remember having this house once, guys, and someone robbed my safe somehow. So I don't know how they managed to do that. I'm going to be honest. If they managed to rob my safe, how? Um, all right. So let's actually go here and uh, look around the balcony. Might be a little hidden thing there, guys. Oh, and another thing about this house, guys. I forgot. 
The roofing was always interesting, the attic in this house. And I don't think a lot of people look at the attic, and that's why we're gonna try to look at that too in a little bit. Okay, so we go down here. Now, I know a lot of people think like, oh, maybe this secret room, what about this right here? A little secret here, does this look like a safe? And I'm gonna be honest, guys, when I first played this, I thought this was a safe too. I hear everybody always saying that. I was like, oh yeah, this is a safe. Uh, and I, that's what I was even calling it at first. I was like, this is 100% the safe. Now, uh, we wanna look behind every possible thing, but this is just a button for some reason that allows you to open up that door so oh, why am i getting creepy vibes from this right now guys i walk down in here and i just get the creepiest vibe ever dude i feel like i'm being watched or about to get killed or something dude. do you ever feel that way i hope you guys don't feel that <laughs> uh, but i'm a bit concerned i'm feeling weird now all right so no safe down in here in the secret meeting room no one who knows what they do down here but um let's go back up here and uh get ourselves out of here all right, thank you. That's a creepy room, dude. Uh, but yeah, so it's just a meeting room. That's all, dude. Don't think too much into it. All right, so we've looked at a clear uh, view of the house, but what we haven't done is looked above here. Now, guys, if you look, there's a bit of an attic in this house, right? There's a bit of an attic. Now, the problem is getting to this attic can be quite difficult depending on where you are, but we're going to try to do it from here. All right, so uh, hopefully this will work. Uh, you, I, I didn't even think about it, guys. You have to position yourself pretty good if you're going to do this. All right, so... Not too successful. <laughs> okay, dude, not too successful there, dude. All right, so... Oh, my God, dude. Okay, so we got to do a ladder jump to a ladder jump. Do I recommend doing this? Nope. But you can do it if you're good enough. All right, so let's see. Dude, if I pull this off. Hit. Oh, dude, it's not working. All right, can I even put my ladder there? Okay, so I can put my ladder there. All right, well, let's try to get it. Let's try to do this. Oh, dude, jeez. All right, so this is uh, this is totally what I planned. All right, I woke up today and was like, this is this is perfect. This is perfect. This is a hundred. Perfect. perfect. Come on. Hit. Hit. It's probably not gonna work too well. All right, guys, one more try. If it doesn't work, we have to give up on this. We have to give up hope. Yep, all right, cool. <laughs> I'm fine, really, I'm fine. Anyways, so uh, yeah, I gotta reposition my house, actually. Uh, you'll love to see it, you'll love to see it. Who's ringing the doorbell here? I don't have it, I don't have it. There's nothing here, sir, can I help you? All right, cool, anyways, so I gotta go replace my house, guys. Give me a minute. What in the world? She's got a face mask on? All right, anyways, guys, welcome back to a new world in Brookhaven. Yep, 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 always in a foreign server somehow. All right, so the house that we actually want to get into is the house that has a area where you can jump on top of the house very easily. Um, I forgot where it is. I think it's up here, uh, the Oaks community. Here we go. Yeah, so I think that's where it's going to be. Yep, see right here is the perfect location for the house. So let's go vacant two. Go ahead and get the house again. This is much better positioning here. Um, and this is gonna do for you think you can see the safe while it's loading? Ooh, sometimes you can see the location of the safes while it's loading, guys. Alright, see how easy this is now? Alright. What? Alright. Yeah, there we go. Now what we want to do is get our bed out. And uh yep, yep, yep. There it is, and try to glitch into this place here. Come on, let me get it. There we go. All right, oh, dude, I can't actually get in there. All right, fine, 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 fine. All right, let's actually look into here. All right. Okay. Do you guys see anything that would resemble a safe, dude? Because if it's gonna be in here, it's gotta be in the attic somewhere, dude. All right, so it looks as if even in the attic of this house, there's nothing that can help us out there. What? All right, so it looks like just as, as we can confirm, guys, there may not be a safe in this house, and this may be the first house with no safe in it, which is kind of hard to believe, honestly, guys, if you think about it, because, I mean, honestly, like, this is huge. All right, let me, come on, dude. There we go. Let's go from this side. Once more, nothing here. So we can even take this a step further, guys. We could start glitching in the walls throughout the house, but I have looked this house from top to bottom, and I have not found one safe anywhere so what's my conclusion to this guys i think we can now from here on out not expect houses to have you guessed it saves uh, especially not rp set houses so this is an rp set house so is this one the vampire house does have a safe somewhere i think but um a lot of the rp houses 
They're just not going to have saves, I, I guess, or not this one in particular, at least. So, uh, it, you know, and it being a frat house, maybe that's more of like a reason why it doesn't have a save. But here's the thing, guys. It's a mystery. And for now, we're going to say we got the truth of this mystery down. There's no safe here, and there's no plans of a safe being added, as this house has other secrets that are very unknown hidden down into the basement so uh hopefully that guy uh, you know that covers it guys and but what i will say if you guys have any more leads on this and where the safe might be or you know the location of the safe please let me know and we'll have to get to looking at it together uh, but either way guys uh shout out to my buddy darzif for also putting me on about this and getting me a little bit involved in this mystery because i saw him talking about it and i was like i gotta talk about where this hidden safe is so that's that either way guys thank you guys for watching the video and i will see you all in the next one Let's crack down on these Brookhaven mysteries. Don't forget to use Star Code Please, don't forget, dude. It's, it's a serious thing, and I need people to use Star Code